Hi, I'm Diane Dillon with the MRA News You Can Use. Today I'm at the fabulous Gaslight Restaurant at Market Street, Linfield. The Massachusetts Department of Public Health has begun the process to adopt the 2013 FDA Food Code and make amendments to the existing sanitary code. The new code can be expected to be adopted in 2017. Massachusetts has been operating under the 1999 FDA Food Code since its adoption. While there are no drastic changes between the two codes, operators can expect to hear different terminology. Non-critical and critical violations will be replaced with the terms core, priority, and priority foundation. We're about ready to get a new Secretary of Labor, Andy Puzder. As the Trump administration rounds into shape, one person to be excited about is the expected new Secretary of Labor. Andy Puzder is the CEO of CKE Restaurants, parent company to Hardee's and Carl's Juniors. Puzder is active in the National Restaurant Association and brings much needed business experience to the Department of Labor. In regards to the labor policy, he has argued that the current administration's rule, expanding eligibility for overtime pay, diminishes opportunities for workers and that significant minimum wage increases would hurt small businesses and lead to job losses. Be aware of the new I-9 forms. The United States Citizen and Immigration Services has announced the new I-9 form will take effect on January 22, 2017. The new version of the I-9 is aimed in part at making it easier for employers and employees to complete portions of the form electronically. Please visit this website for more information. While you're out doing your holiday shopping, why not stop by one of these amazing restaurants at Market Street, Linfield? I'm Diane Dillon with the news you can use, and the MRA and I would like to wish you and your family a happy holiday. We'll see you real soon.